This HAN Network video is brought to you by Bankwell. Bank smart, bank local, bank well. We're going to talk with the boys lacrosse team at Norwalk High School. Frank Renito on the opposite side. I'm Rob Adams, and let's let these guys introduce themselves as they get ready for a big year. I'm Dakar Eason, a midfielder on Norwalk High varsity lacrosse team. I'm Joey LaRocca, senior midfielder, Norwalk High. Harrison Heffron, uh, senior midfielder. Takari, I'm going to start with you. Uh, Fairfield Ward last year, what happened? Uh, well, we knew it was going to be a dogfight going into the game, and uh, it was pretty close. We were going back and forth. I had a big goal in that game. and uh, We ended up pulling through at the end. We won 9-8. It was a uh, good win for us, a good uh, momentum builder and confidence booster. And you and I were talking before we started taping. You're going to head uh, head off to college. Tell us where. I'm going to uh, Mount Ida College, Division for, play Division Three lacrosse next year. All right, good for you and congratulations. And Joey, I was saying to you before we started taping. You know, we all have these memories of certain things that we've done, but you know exactly what happened and the time. And I think that's pretty cool. Tell tell us that story. Yeah, it was the uh, McMahon game sophomore year. Uh, we had a man up, and uh, I looked at the clock right before we started the man up, and it said 150. And then we worked the ball around, and me and Hef actually Hef assisted that goal, and uh, I scored it five hole on Josh Miller with uh, 140 left to go, 144 left to go very in the nice. fourth quarter. That's very and Mount Clair State for you as well, and congratulations on that. What made you want to go there? Uh, well, I want to do finance, and uh, finance is in the city, so that's uh, really close. There's, uh, you can see the skyline of New York from Montclair. So, yeah. Got Yogi Berra Museum right there. Frank. Harrison, congrats to you, too. You'll be joining yep. at Montclair State. That's awesome. We talked about the McMahon game sophomore year. Is that a game that sticks out to you this senior year here? Definitely. It was an overtime game. I felt like if we got the ball, we definitely would have put that one away, but... We got another chance this year. I think we definitely should win, so I'm excited. Who are some of the other games on your schedule that you're looking forward to, one of the big games for you um, guys? Our opener is pretty big against Ward. We beat them last year by one. It was a very close game. I think Wilton is a big one for us this year. They've beat us the past few years. I think we have a team that can play with them this year. So that's also on our senior night. So that, that's one that sticks out to me. I'm very excited. Dakari, earlier today I interviewed uh, the McMahon lacrosse players, and, and they're crowing pretty good about a winning streak against you guys. What do you got to do to break the streak? Well, I mean, so far we're all working hard. We're, if we keep up what we're doing now, then we, we should have any problem in that game. But we, we, ha we have to keep pushing ourselves and keep working like we're doing now to come out on top of that game. Joey, are you able to say, all right, they're, they're our town mates, they're okay over there, or is it a legit rivalry? I think it's a pretty legit rivalry. <laughs> I think uh, if you ask anybody from Norwalk High or McMahon that they'll say the same thing too. And uh, yeah, Very cool. Well, good luck to you guys this year, and uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, I won't root one way or the other. We'll, we'll try to stay neutral, but uh, have a good season regardless. Thank you. Happy to talk with the boys lacrosse team here at, Nor at Norwalk High School, home of the Bears on the HAN Network.